Now, News 3 Sports, sponsored by West Shore Home. Chesapeake resident Jonathan Bach has always had a dedication for serving, especially going into a life of combat. But when that was taken from him years earlier than he expected, Baca pivoted to the only other passion he's known, and that's soccer. Now combining the two, the veteran is giving back with his love of the game and his desire to help others succeed. It's, it's totally a change. Jonathan Baca had everything planned out. A native of Ecuador, he moved to the United States in 2000 and soon began serving the country. I was ready to become an officer in the Navy, so I was striking for that. My goal was to become a Navy SEAL. But in 2005, his plans were torn apart. I have an accident in Iraq, so that was ID explosion in Iraq. I had problem with my knee, with my right knee, and the medical retired me. Unsure of what his next steps would be, Baca turned to what he always knew. My kid was getting frustrated because he was losing and losing and losing. I start coaching their team. The former pro player had found his next path, coaching for nearly a decade before starting the Golden Ball Soccer Academy in 2016. Take the kids out of the streets, okay? Give you an option, and it's very competitive in comparison with the big clubs in Virginia Beach. It's grown leaps and bounds from humble beginnings. So we start with two teams. Technically, we start for four kids. Now I have almost 22 teams. And its impact felt beyond the lessons on the pitch or the trophies collected on a mantle. It's provided me with a family. In my last club, it was like I knew people, but it wasn't like a family. It wasn't like a tight knit group. But here, I found best friends for life. I've become a much better player. These girls, my team is like a family to me, and um, they're like really close friends. Something they credit to Baca's commitment to still serving through soccer. He's always there, he's always cracking jokes. When he's mad, he's mad, but it's always with reason, and it's always met with a wonderful learning opportunity. It may not be exactly the goal he set for himself when he arrived in the United States, but the path that was taken from Baca has led him down the road he was always destined for. It's kind of make me feel good yeah. that maybe I cannot play anymore, but I can teach. Baca said take about 20 of his players overseas tomorrow. They're heading to Spain for a few soccer activities. He'll hope he hopes to excuse me to have a few more recreational teams to go along with those travel squads in the near future. Leandra.